husband, I'm better, blah, 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 all the shit, I don't care. I made that girl rewrite her verse three times for Monster. I supported her career. You understand what I'm saying? So I don't know what it is. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna get this, we gonna get this fucking, or we just ain't gonna push you up, what the fuck? I know you wanna push you up. You know what I'm saying? The, the level, you can say, we still, they cut out, they, they stop, they stop famous. But well, just when we thought the beef between Kanye West and Nicki Minaj had fizzled out, it looks like Kanye is wanting to even dig out more information about it. Now, things really are looking so well for the two. Now, I'm asking myself, why is Kanye doing all of this in the midst or the heat of uh, Nicki Minaj's biggest album, that's uh, Pink Friday 2? Well, let's get into it. But before you know what to do, this is a delicious open ask. Just please do all to in get uh, interactive with us inside the comment section. Let's know what you think about it. Also, inside the comment section, now can he apparently give Nikki a breakout moment delaying? I know his album, and he says this makes no sense. Oops. <laughs> now, Kanye apparently has responded to Nicki Minaj for not clearing her this on uh, his album. Now, guys, we already know that this album was five years ago. Five good years ago. And this is the time where Kanye was wants Nicki Minaj's approval. So the album could apparently come out. Now, West isn't taking rejection well and digital parity also makes worse uh, when discussing or uh, calling out Nicki Minaj's decision not to apparently clear hair uh you know five years old there's for his new album and he apparently says that this is super frustrating now new footages and of course some ranted that Kanye West is getting very personal also because of course his latest album he calls it uh, um Vultures Vegas uh, session surface this Friday. Now via his social media, it captures you know the master uh, rapper ranting about uh, his song New Body, which apparently he wanted to put on the project. Now he told the crowd uh, who apparently were gathered around him uh, that uh, he was forced. Uh, I mean he forced Nicki Minaj apparently to write uh, you know uh, her show Stealing Monster Verse Three. And from the 2010, uh, you know, album that apparently has earned some quite pro quo, uh, you know, requests uh, over the years. However, Nicki Minaj is prepared. Now, we can give you some interesting uh, post. Um, Kanye was posted over there. So let's put this tweet over there uh, where he apparently was, uh, he sent a message. So this is a tweet he, uh, Kanye apparently sent to Nicki Minaj. Now, I'm asking myself, what in the name of God is Kanye West looking for? Like, why does he want Nicki Minaj approval like so bad? Like, this is an album way back in 2000. Oh, no, like, I mean, this album was five years ago. And we all do know that Nicki Minaj is trending. In fact, she is topping chat with her latest album, Pink Friday 2. So I feel like Kanye West wants to catapult on Nicki Minaj's fame or maybe just wants to create controversy about it because we all do know how Kanye is. I mean, Kanye is a very rowdy person, disagree with me or not, but I feel like this is just so unnecessary. Like the back and forth is super, super unnecessary. And in some kind of subtle jab or, you know, response also, looks like Nicki Minaj also is responding one way or the other. But let's go check out this video of Kanye did calling out Nicki Minaj. Of course, we have showed you uh, the tweet already uh, where he apparently sent a private message to Nicki Minaj wanting her approval first before the album comes. But let's do check out this video, which of course saw Kanye going very, very ballistic. In fact, he actually was rowing and said that he apparently contributed to, uh, contributed to Nicki Minaj's career, which I feel is super a damn thing to have said, <laughs> you know, or come out from his mouth. But of course, he says he had a fair share of uh, uplifting Nicki Minaj's career. But let's do check this video out and come back and see exactly what Nicki Minaj also has been responding to. Nicki Minaj has declined Kanye West's request to clear her verse for New Body. It's a collaboration they did many years ago. And now he's responding. My name is Riri and before I get into the tea, follow me for more celebrity and entertainment news. Kanye West tweeted this message he sent to Nicki Minaj. It says, hi, it's Ye. May I call you about clearing New Body on the new album? He even tagged Nicki Minaj. Here is Nicki's response. Yeah, that train has left the station. Okay. No disrespect in any way. I just put out a brand new album. How about we not put out a, a song that has been out for three years? Come on, guys. And here is Kanye's response to Nikki saying no. I that girl rewrite her verse three times for Monster. I supported her career. 
You understand what I'm saying? So I don't know what it is. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna get this, we gonna get this fucking. Or we just say, to push shit up, what the fuck? Nah, Ty, I know you want doesn't his response have the same energy as I made that be famous? Let me know your thoughts. Kanye responds to Nicki Minaj declining new body and I cannot wait to hear your thoughts on this. Kanye West and Ty Dolla Sign are set to release their joint collab album pretty soon and you see the track listing here contains the old viral smash hit new body featuring Nicki Minaj. Kanye posted to his social media that he had texted Nicki Minaj trying to have a discussion about Nicki clearing her verse on new body. It's the most popular verse. Nikki goes on live and tells everyone that the train has left the station. No disrespect, but this is a song that has been out for like three years. It's leaked and she's in the middle of her new album promo run. Like she's, her album just came out. Well, Kanye has finally responded to Nicki Minaj. Kanye is speaking to a room of people and he says, I made that girl rewrite her verse for Monster three times. I supported her career, so I don't know what it is. But to me, you guys, I completely get where Nicki's coming from. For clarity, Nicki was asked to rewrite the new body verse multiple times. Even a gospel version, hallelujah. And when it leaked and was going viral on TikTok, all the makeup tutorials, all of the trends, Nicki asked Kanye to drop new body. The fans of both Nicki Minaj and Kanye West were begging for him to drop new body. Now that we're in the middle of Nicki Minaj's Pink Friday 2 album promo, here you want to come talking about new body verse? Not so fast, mister. What do you think, you guys? Do you think that Nicki Minaj should have cleared her vocals for new body? Do you wonder why Nicki Minaj has Kanye West blocked in her phone too? Tell me in the comments now. So Kanye West doing his thing over there. Now, guys, what do you think about it? Do you think that Nicki Minaj officially should, uh, you know, should respond to it now? I feel Kanye West is just trying to be petty over here. Like, boy is just, because what in the name of God will, uh, I mean, a five-year-old album will be doing in this present state? Like, I just want to understand this conversation. Like, what is happening with Kanye West over there? Like, I, I, I feel like because Nicki Minaj is trending with his, uh, sorry, uh, her latest Pink Friday 2 album, it's 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 giving us though Ye wants to trend or catapult on this to apparently gain some because I do have a record. I mean, I, I, my records and of course my chicks. I have a a clear uh, understanding about this because according to sources, also Nicki Minaj literally begged Kanye West that particular year to have brought the album, but dude decided not to. And so, why is he making it look like Nicki Minaj is the bad person over here? Like. I feel like dude, 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 dude's bipolar once again has, <laughs> well, she says she's not, uh, he's not having bipolar, but I feel like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can disagree inside the comment section, but this is serious. Like it's serious when I, when I say it's really serious. Now people have been talking about it on social media. So maybe you can also leave your thought in comments beneath the comment section. Do you feel Nikki is doing the right thing by avoiding Ye's, uh, you know, album, which apparently is more like more than five years, or do you think she apparently should at least, you know, give a go ahead so everything becomes, uh, you know, cool between the two. But let's check out some interesting conversations also and see what people have been talking about.